Welcome back to Bullet Catcher Gaming. This is, of course, Ghost Recon Breakpoint. Now, this video is going to be speculation heavy. I'm just giving a little warning right at the very beginning because some people like speculation and some people don't because effectively, obviously, it is guesswork. Now, this is complete guesswork. There's no proof of any of this. There's nothing. It's not even really a theory. It's to ask you guys what you think. I think it's always fair to be open and honest about that right at the very beginning. So I'm asking the question, are Wonderland and Motherland either interlinked or are they even the same thing? Or there's also another theory that I've got, which I'll go into a bit later. So let's begin, shall we, by looking at what we know about Motherland to start with. So obviously all we know about Motherland at the moment is that it's the name of the operation that is going to be coming September, October time, where they have said that it's going to be all about replayability and stuff like that. We don't really know anything else other than the fact that Karen Bowman is returning to that. Now, if we have a think for a second, obviously they gave us the roadmap picture of which you would be able you could change the um, lighting settings um, using um, various different means and it showed up the operation was operation motherland as you can see here but if you don't do that and you look at how the writing actually looks without doing it it the way that the kind of lettering lines up looks like it could more likely say Wonderland than it does Motherland. Like, some of the writing doesn't quite add up. So that's quite fascinating. Other than that, we don't really know anything at all about Motherland. Um, that's, of course, until you walk into Erewhon and you go up to J. Skell. And there he is right above his head in big purple letters with the words Motherland. Now we're going to get back to that in a second because let's have a talk um, about what we currently know about Wonderland. So obviously people we know a bit more about what Wonderland is. Now Wonderland is what they call um, the world that they want to build. Like a world where strong men prevail and lead their people to greatness. It's a world where um, force is king. Um, the only thing that matters is that you are prepared to do whatever is needed to reach your goal, no matter the consequences. So basically the actions that we have already seen within the game with Trey Stone and Walker and others trying to kind of enact this going forward now you can go into the clues into the game it says what is wonderland now one of them is a memory of walker um, it's talking about the fact that um, the company man back there whom you never saw by the way believes in um, believes in this fantasy it's called wonderland where people never fight it's all rainbows and marshmallows and unicorns and shit um but I guess we'll talk about that another time. So obviously there's also Joshua Hill's final words that are written in this clue. So he says, you're not going to win. Our wonderland is bigger than a couple of islands in the middle of nowhere, which is interesting. And then the first mention of wonderland, an exchange between Trey Stone and one of his subordinates. He says, I found the guy um, you need for your wonderland. Trey Stone says, oh, I appreciate mid-level managers who still get their hands dirty. Now, it doesn't really tell you a great amount, but it just gives you a little overview. But the interesting thing is, is the last clue. If you click on the last clue, it's nowhere to be found in the game. And all it says is, in time, everything will be revealed. Now, if we're looking at in time, what time is that? Because let's be honest, we are heading down the final moments of this game. I don't think we're going to be getting a whole lot more with this game after this final Motherland update. So where else could this be coming in other than this final clue? Or they've just forgotten about it, which 
would seem very odd to me but then again there have been some things that we all know that kind of story beats that have just been completely forgotten i hope not because this seemed to be one of the core parts of the story um and it would make sense then if they incorporate that last clue into the final kind of update that we receive in this game now obviously got no confirmation that it's the final update but i'm presuming it's the final update um I cannot see this game getting a year three, but, you know, it might. I just can't see it. Um, so, yeah, there we go. That's basically what Wonderland is all about. Obviously, there are other Wonderland um, clues around. Um, I'm going to show a few of them here. So, well, two tray stone from an unknown person. Low max and miles are out of the game will be dealt with to avoid unnecessary complications, blah, blah, blah. Um, Wonderland can survive if you manage to execute Operation Kingmaker. Um, our pawn is waiting to exploit the chaos of the attack's aftermath and is poised to seize control. This one is also relevant, the list of presidential succession, because part of it was to um, wipe out the presidents and their person that they've already got um, their designated survivor would jump in and become president, Jeremy Stoppard, illustrating that he's the intended person meant to assume the role of president in accordance with Operation Kingmaker. Now this one's an important one, Wonderland's plan for the Kingmaker operation. Now it says the alliance with Raven Rock proved fruitful, they acquired and supplied the gas for the Kingmaker operation. Now the plan is to destroy the US government from the top down, starting with the President of the United States, Senate, Congress, the military. They can expand uh, in to include attacks on American citizens, uh, public political events like the State of the Union. Before an attack, a chosen member of the executive branch, uh, an agent loyal to us, will be escorted elsewhere, kept protected as our designated survivor, as I just mentioned in the other clue. Wonderland will benefit from the leadership vacuum that has been created, and our agent, now declared president, will blame the attack on the Russian terrorists. He will convince the public of the dangers of the enemy and seize power indefinitely. This, for me, is a really, really important clue because Motherland is normally always related to Russia being the motherland. And as we can see here, that the blaming the attack on Russian terrorists through Operation Kingmaker. Now, so let's say, for example, perhaps this actually comes to be that Wonderland does happen and the president does take over does that mean then perhaps that wonderland was a success and it's happened hence why we haven't had a final clue yet um who knows don't know but it's very interesting to look at this because obviously like i said motherland it, it starts to you can see some things starting to fit together. Now, yes, is it reaching? A little bit. But you can see some beats here that could happen. Now, none of this may happen, but I definitely think there's something to this. And, of course, there's also the greetings from Wonderland. Um, this was to General Paxton from Lomax Faro Incorporated. In today's wintry political climate, frigid stuffed suits plan cold wars. Fed on a steady diet of corruption, they sacrificed innocent lives for fun and profit. They used their power to further in inequality, famine and civil disorder. Wonderland is the solution to this chaos. With strong principles and powerful governance, we're building a movement free of war and corruption. We've worked with fantastic soldiers like Lieutenant Cole Walker with great success. Now we're looking for highly motivated, dedicated leaders like you to help build a brighter, more substantial future. Given your services as a true patriot, I would be, be in your best interest to consider our offer. One of our associates will be visiting you soon. I truly hope you make the right decision. Regards. Now, once again, I also think this could be playing into possibly a future game um, that will be set up through the motherland which is actually going to be wonderland maybe put into its finality that will then become motherland now let's jump back to jay scow again so obviously if you head over to erewhon and go into his office here you can see motherland why would they put that there why would ubisoft put that there it's been there since the beginning it's like a giant clue perhaps that we didn't notice um, well, we didn't notice it. Well, 
you may have noticed it, but I didn't notice it. Um, but what I find interesting about it is that, I mean, Jay Skell, I've always found him a bit shady. You know, he's a pacifist who he, he doesn't want to get involved in anything, but was making all these armored drones. You know, that he said he got persuaded into doing it. So I don't know. I've never trusted the guy, but it seems a little bit odd to me. And what I find interesting is underneath Motherland, there's this photograph of this little kind of hut. And that reminds me of Bolivia. Like it really looks like some of the locations in Bolivia. And on the other side, round the other, well, on the other side of the wall, it says New York up on the wall. Now, is are they? Have they thrown us out clues from the very beginning about where the where the game is headed? Have they had a, a story ready to go for the next game? Is it going to be about, um, you know, will New York be attacked, for example, by the Russians going through those clues, which then leads to, you know, exactly what they wanted to get from Wonderland? Um, it's I don't know. It, it, it could kind of fits together. Um, I mean, possibly the next game could be called Motherland. I mean, I don't know. D- does it? I don't. Ghost Recon Motherland. I'm not sure it's got a great ring to it. I'm still hoping for Wildlands 2. Um, the fact that Bowman's in it. I'm still sticking by my El Sueño. The canon is that he's alive and that they will end up in Peru or something. I don't know. I still think there's some good, something solid behind that. But. Very interesting. There's also another picture up on the wall, um, which has got, looks like one of the mountains in Breakpoint. And I have had a look around and I thought, oh, I know where this mountain is. But then when I've looked, I can't find anything that matches exactly. So that's quite frustrating as well. But the point of this video was, do you think there's anything in these clues? I'm not saying that any of this is true. What do you think? Is there stuff that I've missed? That's more importantly, have I missed anything? Have I missed any other clues that you think could link any of this together do you guys want to go and have a look if you've got any more info let me know i'd love to know and i'll make a follow-up on it but kind of relying on you guys and and if you think i'm now nah, i think you're well off here um then let me know but you know the fact that motherland has been above jay scale's head i just i don't know i just think there's something there i really do but anyway um i hope you liked the video um thank you so much for all our recent subscribers massively appreciate you all um If you want to hit the like, hugely appreciate that too. Um, And until the next one, stay safe, take care, bye-bye.